Divine Word University has experienced tremendous developments, enabling it to be one of the fastest growing university in the country and also the Pacific. It has hosted numerous high-level government conferences, forums and international gatherings. Students and staff of this Catholic university, both former and current, still speak highly of this institution as it expands in all aspects of its development. One of Divine Word University's longest-serving council member, Sir Peter Bata, told Tumbuna TV, however, businesses and local leaders are yet to acknowledge the university's active contributions towards Medang's growth. The popular DY Math Global Travel Center and Divine Word University Post Office by now are known throughout Medang Town. While they may be Divine Word University's avenues for self-reliance, residents of Medang and even visitors marvel at the type of services they provide. Sir Peter, in a recent interview with Tumona TV, says the church-run National University is taking the lead to be one of the country's finest tertiary institutions. However, its capacity to contribute towards development is yet to be realized by many. It is indeed a pride of Medang, he said. You know, I think it's one of the greatest things that this province, we all can be proud of in this province. It's unfortunate that many of the private sector people don't recognize it. Divine Word University's existence in Medang is of paramount benefit to Medang and those who dwell here. Economic benefits are huge to have such a national institution in Medang, Sir Peter said. He made the remarks while highlighting the university's capacity to host several high-level ministerial meetings of the proposed 2018 Asia-Pacific Economic Cooperation or APEC Summit. You can see it with the open days that we don't always get a, a good response from the private sector. From some members you do, uh, but uh, for instance the Chinese, I never see them down there. Uh, and probably the other half the economy in Medang at the moment, they own half the town anyway. But, you know, I think that what I'm getting at is that the town has to really recognise that Divide Wood University is an important economic part of the town, apart from being one of the top educational facilities in the country. Apart from infrastructure development, the university has also embarked on partnership programmes with international universities. Through its vibrant information and communication technology department, Divine Word University's unique one laptop per scholar policy has also attracted a huge number of applicants from right across the country and the neighboring Solomon Islands, also setting a benchmark for other universities in the country. David Wapar for Tumuna TV News, Medellin.